today will present the top eight tanks with the best armor, featuring cutting-edge protection technologies. Now, without further ado, let's get to it. Number eight, the Leclerc XLR. This tank features enhanced modular composite armor on the turret front and hull sides, improving protection against anti-tank guided missiles and chemical energy rounds. Sled armor has been added to the rear to shield the engine compartment from RPGs and other threats. The tank is equipped with a mine and IED protection kit, increasing survivability in asymmetric warfare. An anti-RPG protection kit further strengthens its defense against close-range attacks. The Galax Close Protection System provides active countermeasures against incoming threats. The tank also features counter-IED jammers to disrupt remote detonated explosives. Its automatic fire suppression system enhances crew safety by quickly extinguishing fires. A laser warning system alerts the crew to enemy targeting, allowing rapid defensive action. Number 7. The Type 99A This China's MBT has a welded angular turret with spaced modular armor and composite panels giving it strong protection. Its applique armor includes modular plates and track skirts, enhancing survivability. The tank may use third-generation Relict Type Era, which helps defend against tandem charge warheads. Its combined armor protection exceeds 1000 mm of RHA, making it highly resistant to modern threats. The storage baskets on the turret act as buffer spaces and are reinforced with Era blocks for added defense. It features a nuclear biological chemical protection system and a fire detection and suppression system to improve crew safety. The GL6 active protection system can intercept ATGMs, RPGs, and high-speed projectiles before they hit the tank. For additional protection, it has 12 81mm smoke grenade launchers and can generate a smoke screen by injecting fuel into the engine. Number 6. The T-14 Armada features advanced armor protection using 44S SVHS steel, which is highly durable and 15% lighter than older tank steels. Its composite armor integrates an unknown ceramic layer and built-in era, forming a continuous protective layer rather than separate blocks. The base composite armor is believed to provide protection equivalent to 900 to 1100 mm of rolled homogeneous armor against kinetic energy penetrators and 1200 to 1400 mm RHA against shape charges. The tank's Melikit Dual Era system covers the front, sides, and top, enhancing defense against kinetic and shape charge threats. Additional applique armor protects the forward two thirds of the hull while slat armor shields the rear. The internal armored crew capsule isolates personnel from ammunition and potential explosions. The Afghanit APS combines soft kill measures like jamming guided missiles with hard kill interceptors against incoming threats. Russian sources claim Afghanit can neutralize APF-SDS rounds traveling at 1.5 to 2 km per second, though this remains unverified. Number 5. The Merkava Mark V Also known as the Barak, it is Israel's latest main battle tank, building upon the advancements of its predecessors. It features a modular armor system that allows for quick replacement and upgrading of armor components enhancing battlefield adaptability. The tank incorporates advanced composite materials including laminated ceramic steel nickel alloys, providing robust protection against various threats. The armor is designed with sloped configuration, improving its effectiveness against incoming projectiles. Additionally, the Merkava Mark V is equipped with a trophy active protection system, which detects and neutralizes incoming anti-tank missiles and rockets, significantly enhancing crew survivability. The tank's design continues the Merkava tradition of front-mounted engines, adding an extra layer of protection for the crew by positioning the engine as a shield against frontal attacks. Internally, the tank is fitted with a small liner to reduce crew injuries in the event of armor protection. Number 4. The K2 Black Panther, which is South Korea's most advanced MBT, featuring a combination of composite armor and advanced era for superior protection. 
the Frenzel armor is about 800 mm thick, approximately, and is believed to be capable of withstanding modern APF SDS rounds, while error blocks on the turret provides additional defense against tandem charge warheads. Its hard kill APS can detect, track, and neutralize incoming threats, reducing the effectiveness of ATGMs. The K2's lightweight composite material offer high protection without compromising mobility. Blowout panels in the ammunition storage compartment ensures that the crew is protected in case of internal detonations. The modular armor system allows for future upgrades, keeping the tank relevant in modern warfare. The sides of the tank are covered with special armor plates, which reduce the impact of RPGs and other explosives. The bottom of the tank is reinforced, making it resistant to landmines. At number 3, the Leopard 2A7. This tank uses a combination of spaced multi-layer composite armor and laminated armor modules. The main armor consists of showbam type armor composite. The tank is reinforced with additional laminated armor modules, giving it a distinctive arrowhead shape to improve defense against kinetic energy penetrators and shape charges. The frontal arc of the turret is covered with these new armor modules, significantly increasing survivability. The side skirt have also been upgraded with improved armor protection to shield against RPGs and other threats. The Leopard 2A7 features the latest generation of passive armor and belly armor providing protection against mines and IEDs. A 25mm ball liner is installed inside the tank to reduce injuries to the crew in case of armor protection. The multi-layer spaced armor from early models was further modified in this version to increase its defensive capability. During upgrades, the roof covering the armor modules is cut open to insert these new protective layers. The tank can also be fitted with modular armor packages for urban combat, allowing additional protection based on mission requirement. The armor of the Leopard 2A is believed to provide protection equivalent to 960mm armor steel against kinetic energy penetrators and more than 1000mm RHA against shape charge warheads. Number 2. The Challenger 3 This is a British main battle tank, featuring a new modular armor system, likely incorporating the latest Chobam, Dorchester composite armor and silicon carbide tiles for exceptional protection. It retains the Challenger 2's reputation for having one of the best protected turret designs, with an emphasis on multi-layered composite armor. The turret and frontal hull armor are designed to resist modern APF STS rounds particularly those fired from 120mm smoothbore guns used by NATO and Russian MPTs. Its front armor is over 900mm thick. The tank is equipped with Trophy APS, providing enhanced protection against ATGMs and RPGs. A reinforced belly plate offers improved resistance against mines and IEDs, making it suitable for urban and asymmetric warfare. The armored ammunition storage ensures does not result in catastrophic internal explosions. At number 1, the M1A2 Sep V3 Abrams. It has some of the strongest armor ever built, using a mix of Chobam composite armor, depleted uranium plates and silicon carbide tiles. Chobam composite armor is made of layered ceramics, metals, and other materials which absorb and spread the force of enemy shells reducing penetration. Depleted uranium plates are extremely dense and add extra protection by resisting high-speed armor-piercing rounds. While the silicon carbide tiles further improve protection by being lightweight yet extremely hard, enhancing resistance against kinetic energy penetrators and shaped charge warheads. Together, they provide strong defense, making this tank highly resistant to modern threats. The front turret armor is approximately 900mm thick making it nearly impossible to destroy with tank shells. It also has the Trophy Active Protection System, which can shoot down incoming missiles and RPGs. The hull is covered in extra armor to protect against mines and roadside bombs. Its explosive armor, ERA, can absorb missile blasts, keeping the tank safe in battle. It has blowout panels in the back, so if the ammo inside explodes, the crew stays safe. With this guys, we're signing off for today, but don't forget to hit that notification bell and we'll see you guys again in our next video, bye bye.